in order to do good science, you challenge assumptions. And one of the reasons that I think women can be particularly good at it is that in this day and age, in order to be in science at all, we've spent our lives challenging assumptions about who we are and what we can do. So going into a scientific field where there's a rigid way of thinking about things and busting that open and looking at, at problems in new ways ought to just come really naturally to us. This is, this is really, really hard work. But I cannot think of anything that I could spend the rest of my life engaged in that would be more exciting and would have more potential to make a tremendous impact. And I can think of no challenge that would draw young women into this field greater than knowing that what they're doing is not sitting in a lab doing stuff that is disconnected from the world. They're sitting in a lab doing something that is very, very connected. And they can bring their whole, their whole selves to it. Their full sense of what the world is. The intuition that we're so famous for. <laughs> and that it's OK to do that. You don't have to put that in the closet anymore keep that at home anymore. I hope you all go out of here struggling for progress and not worrying about getting permission. You get your own permission from inside and it's the right thing to do.